Hello friends, today we are going to prove that root 5 is an irrational number. First of all, we should know what is the definition of irrational number. There is no such proper definition for irrational numbers. Actually, we say that the numbers which are not rational are called irrational numbers. So here also we are going to prove something like that only. Directly we cannot prove that root 5 is irrational. So we are going to first assume that root 5 is rational. And then we are going to find some mistakes. So that we come to know that root 5 is not rational. So if root 5 is not rational then automatically it will become root 5 is irrational. So this is called a contradiction method or whatever you like you can give name. Uh, so first we are going to assume that root 5 is a rational number. So suppose root 5 is a rational number. So what we can say, if it is a rational number, we can say that root 5 is equal to a by b, where a and b are co-prime. Some students don't know what are co-primes, means further we cannot find factors of this number, means if 6 upon 8 is there, we can cancel and write down 3 by 4. Now after 3 by 4 we cannot cancel. So 3 and 4 are not having any common factors. Means here A and B should not have any common factors. That's for they are called co-prime. So first we will assume root 5 is equal to A by B where A and B are co-prime number. They don't have any common factor. And now we are going to solve it. First B is in denominator. We will take it here. So we will get a proper simple equation now first we have to remove this root so that simple numbers so squaring both the sides you have to write the statement so what will this under root 5 square will give you 5b square is equal to a square now clearly we can say these are equal means 5b square equals to a square so 5 is with this LHS so we can say there in a square also there is one 5 so we can say there therefore a square is divisible by 5 and so we can say that a is also divisible by 5 Take it as result number 1. Now we come to know that A is divisible by 5. So in the place of A, we can suppose some number with 5 in it. So we will suppose, suppose A is equal to 5C. So in the place of A, we are going to write, look here, we are going to put in the place of A, 5c so it will become 5b square is equal to 5c whole square now again we are going to open it it will be 5b square is equal to 25c square now take this 5 here b square is equal to 25 by 5c square so 5 and 5 so now we got 5b b square is equal to 5c square now again we can see 5 is here so n equal to so somewhere in b square also there is one 5 so what we can say we can say b square is divisible by 5 so b is also divisible by 5 so this is result number 2 
in result number 1 we got a is divisible by 5 in result number 2 we got b is also divisible by 5 from 1 and 2 we get from 1 and 2 we get that a and b are having a common factor 5 from 1 and 2 that a and b is having a common factor 5 which is opposite to our supposition where a and b were co prime so this contradiction but actually a and b were co prime in the our supposition so you have to write but a and B are co prime. This contradiction has arisen because of our incorrect assumption. So we can say that root 3 is not a rational number. So if it is not a rational number, then it is a irrational number. So this way we can find or prove that root 5 is irrational. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.